welcome back everyone at 710, which means it's also time to talk with our Keeping It Positive correspondent and contributor, Mary Curtis. She joins me this morning to talk about a project that's expected to breathe some new life into Northwest Charlotte. And this is what I'm really, really looking forward to. There's really been a lot of focus, if you will, on that Northwest Charlotte Babies Ford Corridor. There really has. You know, I say Keeping It Positive, I'm your woman about town. Uh -huh. And that's a part of town that I've been up to a lot lately because things are happening. Uh, yeah, and last week I was at the opening of mm -hmm. Mosaic Village. And that was a really big deal. Obviously, it's something that kind of seems to be spearheaded by Johnson C. Smith University. And Johnson C. Smith University, just in general, is kind of the heart of that baby's Ford quarter now. It is. And I spoke with the president, uh, Ron Carter, who talked about you have to be persistent with your vision. And it seems that they have had a vision going from West Trade up through Beatty's Ford. Now, this is a very colorful, as it says, mosaic village. Mm -hmm. has a beautiful mural on the side uh, of some iconic scenes of the West Side. There was a young artist there. There's a going through the I-77 underpass as a piece of public art. And these sweet apartments are very beautiful. I took a tour, a little preview of it, and they're going to be available for students, uh, not just at JCSU, but for all the other universities. Mm -hmm. And also members of the community will be able to go in. There's reading lounges, study halls, a fitness room, and right. on the top floor, a beautiful rooftop garden with a with a view of uptown skyline and people will be able to hire it out for receptions and parties so that's just a piece of it right down the road is the arts factory okay. uh, and that i went to a play there it's a visual and performing arts center the gold rush is now going up there a lot of life going on and mary all that development isn't just about developing the west side it's also about kind of connecting uptown to the west side and to that corridor. Yeah, and we saw that a little bit during the DNC where there right. were activities saying, you know, everything's going on not just in uptown, but up the corridor. And it's not that far. You can take the gold rush. And I think people will be surprised. But these new apartments, the students and the Johnson C. Mm. Smith band were out there. And it's one of those city of Charlotte, Johnson C. Smith, uh, uh, public-private partnerships. Right. Also, Griffin Brothers, you know, the Griffin Tires and all. Griffin Brothers are, are a piece of that. And, and let's not forget, Mayor Fox is a product of West Charlotte. He is. He's a, and so he's, it's yes. kind of close to his heart as well. It is close to his heart, and sometimes we haven't seen that part of the city mm -hmm. get the attention, I would say. And, he, of course, Mayor Fox was there. He was kind of moved by all of this. He is a product of that area, went to West Charlotte, and went to then Davidson, and he's the mayor of the city. So there's a lot of talent up there, mm -hmm. and maybe we're not seeing it, but, of course, now we're seeing all of these different developments. And it's going to continue. I mean, it's not just going to be limited to Mosaic Village and some of these things. Do you think that you'll see, we'll continue to see more development there along that corridor and just in West Charlotte in general? I believe you will. And you'll see people who are already up there, like the folks at Friendship Missionary Baptist who are further up on Beatty's Ford. And mm -hmm. you see that this Saturday they're having a men's health symposium free, open to okay. the public, men 21 and above, to get things like high blood pressure screenings, glaucoma screenings. You go up it from 8 to 1. So they're trying to bring the community together and do all of these things that are going to uplift the community and see all the positive things. You know, I had to get that in there. <laughs> happening in that corridor. Well, Mary, you know I can't